Hey guys, uh, welcome to your love reading uh, for Leo, the person that is on your mind. Uh, this is going to be for February 2022. You can apply this to your sun, moon, rising, and Venus signs. So we're going to take a look at your person, you know, what they're up to, what their over energies are like. So this could be in regard to someone that you separated with or that someone that you're currently dealing with. Uh, so just apply this to your own unique situation and then we'll finish off the read to see what their future actions are towards you. Uh, apply this to your own unique situation, okay? Like I said, switch the rules if you want. Keep in mind that these are general messages. Take what resonates, leave the rest behind. Uh, if you guys haven't done so yet, uh, hit the subscription button and the notification bell so that you guys get notified on when my new videos post. Give this video a thumbs up, like this video so that this message can circulate around to the individuals that need to hear this. Share this video with someone if you feel like there's someone out there that you know that needs to hear this. And leave a comment down in the comment section below if this message resonates. For those of you guys that are interested in booking a private personal reading with me, the link is in the description box below. All right, let's get started. Uh, tell me about the person that is currently on Leo's mind. What is this person up to? What are their over energies are like? How are they feeling towards Leo? Sun, moon, rising, Venus. Signs for February 2022. Like I said, this could be someone that you've lost touch with, that you've broken up with, or that this is someone that uh, you're currently dealing with, okay? Even though this is love focused, like this could be with anybody. Um, all right, we have the Emperor here and the Hierophant. Aries energy, uh, Taurus energy. Could be dealing with an Aries here or a Taurus. You could have those energies in your chart too, Leo. Nine of Wands and the Strength card. This person really has their boundaries up, okay? So I feel like if you're separated from this person and this person left, I feel like this person has made up their mind and I, I feel like this person's keeping the word, okay? This person's not changing their mind, all right? Three of Wands and Temperance. So, Sagittarius energy. Keep in mind, you can switch the rules if you want. Maybe this is you uh, in this energy right now, okay? Uh, we do have that Strength card there, Leo energy. Yeah, it just seems like someone here is keeping their word. They're not changing their mind. They're just looking, someone here is looking towards the future here, con continuing on focusing on their healing, okay? Um, Let's see, the Emperor, Four of Pentacles. So we have someone here that's really keeping to themselves. This is someone that maybe you haven't spoken to you um, or that, you know, you try to speak with this individual, but they don't give you a lot of information here, okay? Or that this person is just not really ready to invest in you. Or that this person was invested in you, but I'm not quite sure what happened here. But we'll, we'll pull, pull some more cards just to see what's going on. We have uh, the Sun, Leo energy. Um, so Leo, whoever this person is, I feel like this person is really happy with where they're at right now. Okay? Um, I do feel like this is someone where a lot of people turn to. For this uh, to this to this individual for advice, maybe this person does some sort of work in um, you know coaching or something like that, a therapist, a spiritual advisor. Tell me about the uh, nine of wands and the page of wands. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius energy. Like I said, you could be dealing with another Leo here. Strength, Ace of Wands. I mean, you could be reaching out to this person, but whoever this person is, this person's not interested, okay? I feel like this person's right right now is really focusing on their own passions in life. Uh, three of Wands. Ace of Swords. You know, I feel like this person's off, you know, 
going through like a, a spiritual awakening or something like that. Okay, I feel like this person could be traveling a lot regarding their work here. Uh, tell me about temperance. The full Aries energy, Aquarius energy. Yeah, I, I just feel like this person's on a completely different path now. You know, I feel like with the Ten of Wands here, this person probably released a lot of burdens in their life, okay? So I just feel like there's an energy with this individual that they're moving on, all right? Like I said, Leo, this could be you in this type of energy right now. Like I said, you could switch the roles if you want. All right, uh, well... Will the person that is on Leo's mind take any uh, future actions towards Leo? Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs for February 2022. All Nine of Wands and the Sun. You have the Nine of Wands and the Sun again. I don't think this person is going to take any sort of action towards you. But if this person's just, you know, doing fine, doing well. Um, seven of Swords and a Four of Pentacles, okay? I feel like this person is really protecting themselves right now. So regarding this person, there could have been some stuff that has been taken from them. And I just feel like this person does, doesn't want to go down that road again. Six of Swords and the Knight of Pentacles. You see, I feel like this person's just moving on. Slowly moving on. Slowly focusing on other things. You know, working on their money, working on their career here. Um, whoever this person is, this person's a really hard worker. Um... Nine of Wands. Page of Wands and the Hierophant again. Why is the sun here? Oh, let's see. Why is the sun here? Ace of Swords, I feel like this person's on a spiritual path. You could be on a spiritual path here too, Leo. Seven of Swords. Five of Cups. You know, I just feel like we have someone here that's really protecting their energy. I feel like this person does not want to be let down by anyone in general, okay? Yeah. Uh, not just you, but just anybody. Four of Pentacles and the Magician here. Virgo energy. Gemini energy. You know, I feel like... Um, I do feel like this person... I mean, you could be dealing with this person right now, but... I mean, like I said, you could apply this to your own unique situation, but... This person is this, in this energy of really manifesting right now, okay? Uh, manifesting good things in their life. Six of Swords. The Knight of Wands. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius energy. Uh, the Knight of Pentacles. And the Three of Swords. You see, I feel like this person's really moving on from some sort of heartbreak that they were dealing Yeah, you see... Um, it could have been the third party situation. There could have been the major betrayal here. It just seems like someone here is moving on, moving on towards their healing, okay? So, so Leo, uh, I hope this was helpful. I hope this resonated. If it did, leave a comment down in the comment section below. Share this video, like this video if you haven't done so yet. Uh, subscribe, hit the notification bell. I will speak to you guys in the next one. All right. Thanks, guys. Bye.